I feel like I let her down. And um, she knows I love her, though. I would not do that on purpose. It's been five and a half years of pain, frustration, regret, and heartache. But still, no answers for Caroline Tokar, who just wants to know where her daughter is. I want to hear your voice again. I want to hear you sing. Sorry. A press conference was held right behind us to share the latest on the search for 41-year-old Amanda Dean, who was first reported missing out of Huron County in July of 2017. What makes you think that your family's not going to look for, a, you know, your loved one? It's been five and a half years. It's not like Amanda to do that. Tokar says this all began in July of 2017, when their family alerted the Huron County Sheriff's Office that they were concerned about Amanda's whereabouts. Now, at the time, Tokar says her daughter was a victim of an abusive relationship, and her silence for two straight weeks was totally out of character. The search for Amanda lasted just 24 hours, and it was called off because law enforcement had confirmed that she was at a safe house. However, Tokar hasn't had any contact with her daughter since that day and was constantly given the same answer about Amanda's whereabouts. He said that Amanda's an adult. If Amanda wants to contact her family, that is at her discretion, um, but that she was safe. Until about two weeks ago, when Tokar says they filed a proof of life letter to the Huron County Sheriff, Todd Corbin. He didn't come back to me and tell me personally, but he did say he couldn't give us that proof. Which means that the search for Amanda Dean resumes five and a half years later with BCI now leading the investigation. Tokar believes it should not have taken this much time, but she does credit Missing Cleveland, an organization co-founded by Gina DeJesus, for making this moment possible. They were doing things that I, we, there's no way we would have known how to even approach this. No suspects have been identified in this case for now, but Fox 8 was told that the investigation is still in an early stage by law enforcement. If you have any information regarding Amanda's disappearance, please contact either BCI or the Huron County Sheriff's Office. I think they'll, they'll get us answers here soon. Uh, it won't be another five and a half years.